Hello guys, welcome to React Quick Lesson for Beginners. In this lesson, we are going to learn one thing. Most beginners are already familiar how to loop through array and display the items from those arrays. But they get confused when it has to do with objects. Let me quickly show you what I mean. By the way, what I have on the screen is a fresh React application, which I created with the Create React app. And with npm start, I have the application running on the browser. Over here, I added a file data.js. Inside the data.js are the items we are going to display. The first one is an array, which most people are familiar with already, with beginners. You can just um, walk through these arrays and display the items. But some people get confused when it has to do with objects. Right, so this is the list of countries. This is a, an object actually, instead of an array like we have up here. First, we are going to quickly display the list, the items from the continents array, and then we see how we can do it differently when it comes to objects. In this case, the object is for currencies. Over to app.js, the first thing I'm going to do is to import those things we have in data.js import from data we import the continents and the currencies then I will delete what we have displaying on the screen I will just remove the header element and its content here let's quickly um, display the continents so basically what you can do is continent inside the curly braces like I have it continent dot map continent note that this note that this is singular this is plural actually we can do this in one line like so you can say h3 continent save that you can see we have the list of continents this is an array we are working with arrays of continents remember right so basically what we can do is array dot map inside here we have each of the items each of the items in the array and we can display it like this that is straightforward but in the case of currencies, which is an object, if we try to do something similar, it is not going to work. Let me actually replace continents with currency. And here, change it to currency, singular. Change this to currency, or maybe currency dot. I don't know. Let me just leave it like this for now. If I go here, you see we have an error. We cannot do it just straightforward like this in the case of objects how are we going to look through the object and display the contents now there are different ways you can do this right if you do a google search you can find different answers one of the ways we can do this is to make use of keys method you can see this example here we have an object with key value key value key value when we call object dot keys on that object we get array of the keys this is something we can work with so basically for this object we have here we can call object dot keys on currencies that will give us each of these keys as an array and of course whenever you have key you can access item from that object let's see this in action what i will do is to delete what we have inside the curly braces and we are going to say object dot keys and this will give us that is for currencies actually then we say dot map right remember that object dot keys will give us array of the keys and on a on array we can call the map method right so dot map but this time we get the key instead of the whole 
object or the whole item. With the keys, we can do something similar that we did earlier. We can say key. Let's just display the key for now. I will go back to the page. You can see that we have the keys. But with the key, we can get the actual value for that object. So let me just put a colon here and we go again currencies, the key. Save that. We come back here. You can see that we have both the key and value. So object.keys is one of the ways you can actually loop through an object in React and display the content. I hope that makes sense. Until next time, happy coding.